Hey guys, what is up? I'm back, and today, uh, it's not a tutorial, I just, uh, I was thinking about something, uh, basically going over the update log for this week. There's also something I didn't talk about in the last video, so I'll start off with that. So basically, uh, since it's the 4th of July, there's been a code added instead of a full-blown event. This is because of two reasons, uh, I'll, I'll, after, I'll say them after I put the code in. It's independence, uh, 20... 20 right indie i can't spell it right independence 2020 okay I, sick you're good at spelling you and then you get you get starry spectra ability now, the reason a full-blown event hasn't been added for these months is one of two reasons being that uh paul didn't really have anything ready for this time and also i think that the 4th of july since it's just based in america uh this event's going to be removed because uh and replaced with a summertime event instead i believe uh the exact words were uh, yeah an annual summer event and uh, here we go. I didn't comment on it, but uh, I saw the spectrability holding like instead of its cards, like little stars. I think this looks quite nice actually. It suits the. I mean, I, I like this little top part and um, the firework it's holding. Yeah, I think this is a nice um, uh, patriotic skin. Wait, what's this called? Is it just called the starry skin? That'd be interesting if it is. I think it is. But yeah. The next week, I might just keep going over the update logs. Tell me if you guys want more, or just me brushing over the new updates to Ethereum. So there's also a remodel that's been added. It may as well be a separate Ethereum because in case you haven't checked, I'd look at the Tarot line if I. Oh my god, all the skins, all the skins. I don't have the elusive. I'm not getting the heritage because God, it, it sucks. But <laughs> no offense to. Never mind. I forgot who made it. Uh, okay, so. Now let's just look at the terror line. I did cover this in another video, like, but obviously, no, okay, as the animations, the tentacles, they look a bit off-putting, but I, I still like them, like, with the whole line design. It's just an aesthetic. I wonder, what's its idle animation? I think it just sits, right? And you can hardly tell. I mean, I saw, I mean, actually, it is a different shade, but, oh, slash sit, let me type that in, of course. Slash sit, there we go. Well, <laughs> okay, but still, it's quite nice. Now, let's uh, look at the whole line. Gem oh, even the art's changed. I don't know who made this art, actually. I should probably ask in the Discord. But yeah, here we go. Oh, it's it's very nice to actually see this in-game compared to just what screenshots of this were. And of course, uh, the eyes that were like... I've realised that the eyes remind me of, uh, you know, the portals from, you know, the portal games, the blue and orange ones. I really like this new Tarot line design. I think it looks great. And now for Gaioth. God, oh, even the art's changed. I, I don't know who did that, but I, I didn't know that happened. But it's also been changed. I didn't. I didn't. I haven't said this as well. But the base that have also changed with the uh, Teru having plus ten rest, uh, one more speed. Uh, Gemina having minus one NRG and plus six rest and two speed. And Gaioth having plus five speed. And uh, yeah, here's uh, Gaioth. And let's see. Uh, whoa, I didn't cover. I didn't. I mean, I think Gemina's walk animation was him, but. Wow, it's like, it is like this big uh, goliath just like tumbling its way towards you. And the tree, oh, the way the tree moves, oh, I love this remodel so much. Uh, the tarot line can also learn Razor Leaf at level 25, which is interesting. And uh, I don't know if you've noticed, but if you've been to a uh, spawn recently, you might have noticed that uh, the kitchenette has now uh, had its name changed. And it's now called the Baker's Corner, I believe. Let's uh, take a look at it. I haven't paid much attention to it. And yeah, look okay, at the Baker's Corner. And there has been two titles, there's been four titles actually added this week. Uh, Hilo, Cup Gamer, and there's two secret titles. I don't know what they are. I'll probably do some digging into that. But let's see, how much is the Heritage skin on sale for? Uh, Training Ground, why do you sell skins? There we go. It is on sale for 350, so if you want to get that, you can. But honestly, I don't know why you would. This remodel looks so much better. Okay, and I th and besides all the patriotic skins that are already there, but I think that's uh, it for the most interesting things for the update log. There's been oh, actually I didn't mention that these are, the places have actually been remodeled. Uh, the, all the shops I think yes, general shop, a lucky lot of training ground, and baker's corner buildings. Now uh, basically it will cause less lag for you, but you might not have noticed the remodels. But I think that's practically all the main interesting and notable changes from the update log. Please do let me know if you want me to cover more of the update log uh, every week. I might do that. But that's it for this video. Hope you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And do let me know if you want videos on the two secret tiles. I'll see if I can find out what they are and how to get them. But besides that, bye.